Oh, I just literally hit my knee. <laughs> I literally just hit my knee on this chair. Okay, all right. Let's get this going. All right, what's up, YouTube? Okay. My name is Peter Safa. This is Christopher Miles Smith. I look pale. Look how pale I am. You look absolutely pale. All right, so we are at the Bell of the Tacos right now. Did you lift it up, maybe? We are we are at Taco we are at Taco Bell right now, and they apparently came out with French fries last week. Absolutely mm, impeccable. Well, fries. they look impeccable. All right, it's no. nacho cheese fries, guys, and we're gonna give them a shot. Here we go. First initial taste is gonna be Peter Saffa. Peter, give us your taste test. You ready for this? All right. It's a little hot. Did you just blow on the French fry? You're about no, to put no, it in the my cheese. Mouth. The cheese is like smoking. Right. I don't want to. I don't want right, to smoke it. That was weird. Dude, how are they, dude? They're very full. Wow. They're definitely. I'm going in. They're in definitely it. packed with with a lot of potatoes. I think. <laughs> Look at that little steam. Oh my god. Mmm. Mm. Yeah, I mean, wow. Just Real. down the hatch. Wow, those are good. They're full, right? Those are way better than any other fries. Okay. Would you? I right, would you, you might have some these? confusion in the ranks. Would you go these over McDonald's fries? Oh, well, McDonald's, yes. But now, when it comes to Steak and Shake, no, these are over Steak and Shake, hundred percent. I actually disagree with that. Why? Because these are like girthy. They're good. Give me another one. I'm just sitting here. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah. These are phenomenal. Yeah, they're not bad. Wow. Okay, so one out of ten. Honestly? One out of ten. I'd give it like a nine point five. I would almost agree with that. What would you think about? I would just, I would say nine. I mean I've never had a French fry like oh my gosh. No, that this is, is close to oh my gosh. Seriously, you're that in love. This is All right, so I would encourage you to have a fry without the cheese sauce, just like plain Jane. Okay. Plain Jane fry. Alright, here we go. Well, cheers. Cheers. I mean, good they're, they're good. Yeah. No, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna like them because they don't taste like an everyday fry. That's true. They're unique. That's true. Very unique. All right, let's go ahead and do this. Oh yeah. What's, so it, what's in the video? Show them. Show them. Show them. All right, here we go. This is a nacho supreme, except it's a French fry supreme. Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Dig it. Ooh, that looks good. That looks really good. You ready? I'm gonna get down and dirty in it. You're gonna go. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Wow. All right, here we go. Did you just slurp that French fry? Did I just hear you slurp? No. I'll deny that. Oh, I'm just getting in there, alright. I'm just on the ends, yeah. That's pretty good, dude. Alright. Alright, final thoughts. Taco Bell, you did well. You did really well. Way better than uh, McDonald's. Yeah. What about Wendy's? Now, when it comes Wendy's to curly good. fries, I think Arby's has you in curly fries because it's like a curly fry, but then Chick fil A has you in like a waffle fry because it's a waffle fry. But when it comes to regular fries, this right here. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna crush these. You're gonna give it up. No, ma. Crush them? Oh, I'm busy, you know, telling these people about French fries while you're over here. So, final review? Challenge. Go try them. They're a dollar. They're literally a doll hair. Literally a doll hair. They're literally a doll hair. So, we'll see you guys next video. Thanks for watching this video. Follow me on Instagram down below. You already know him, so, yeah, do that. We'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace.